Hello, I'm Dr. Christina Callahan. I'm an audiologist here to discuss your test results, what they mean, and how they relate to your everyday life. Then we'll talk about how you can hear better. Your tone test indicates that you have difficulty hearing high, mid, and low frequencies. Let's put this into context. Oftentimes, people think of hearing loss in terms of volume or loudness when really it's more of an issue of understanding. People say, I hear someone speaking, but I don't understand what they're saying. Those with high and mid frequency hearing loss have trouble hearing consonant sounds. Let's break that down. First, vowel sounds like the uh in bat or the oo in food. They're low in frequency and responsible for the loudness and richness of speech. Meanwhile, consonant sounds like the st in stack or the the in that are high in frequency and crucial for speech clarity. If any of these sounds are hard to hear, understanding suffers. Let's use these words in a sentence. The fat cat ate the food. When you have hearing loss across frequencies, you might lose that consonant sound in fat cat or the oo vowel sound in food, making you wonder whether it was a fat cat or a bat or a rat eating a, eating a what? Now, you may be able to use context clues to determine the word, but keep in mind there won't always be just one misunderstood word in a conversation, so you'll likely miss other ones. Playing this fill in the blank game can be really tough. This is a very simple way to explain hearing loss, which of course is more complicated. Hearing devices make sounds louder and clearer, and adjustments with a hearing professional can fine tune the device to you even more. Translation, better hearing, feeling more confident at work, a quieter TV, feeling more engaged in the world around you.